Hello, my friends on Periscope, and those of you that aren't my friends, you might like me if you friends. get to know me. <laughs> I'm a nice guy mom, if you mom. get to know me. Okay. Mom, Carson's in the car with us. Carson is in the Carson's car. Carson's not fasting. And I want you to notice Carson and his chocolate milk from Chick fil A. Uh, I want to say and leftover nuggets. That leftover we're not chicken nuggets right mom. here. Chicken nuggets, people. Leftover. Oh, chicken nuggets. Is there anything better than a Chick fil A chicken nugget? French waffle fries. We're oh. not eating them. Okay, now look here. Because we're fasting. That's the deal. Do you realize how difficult it is to not eat a Chick fil A chicken nugget because we're fasting? Mom! And, uh, oh, that was loud. Carson? Mom. Carson, I'm trying to talk about the fast. <laughs> um, Wi-Fi doesn't work on there. You can use so, my phone. So anyway, I your your Wi-Fi work. Just wanted to talk about our day again. We had a pretty good day. We were, had meetings this morning, uh, planning future things for uh, our worship department at Covenant Church. But uh, this is what it's 5:35 of our third day. Um, there you go, bud. I want I to encourage oh, everyone oh, to continue okay. to pursue. Carson is not Don't just go <laughs> through the. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Just listen to me. Just uh, I want to uh, encourage you to continue to pursue. Uh, it would be easy to just coast through a day and forget, uh, and you're just fasting for the sake of not eating food. It's just like, and then if that's the case, it's no more than a diet. This is not a diet. This is. Uh, sacrificing things that we love things that are important things uh, uh, so that we can die to our flesh and and seek first the kingdom and uh, uh, I want to remind you that we have to change the way we think in order to see the kingdom and so fasting helps us helps us shift our mind helps us to uh, take our thoughts into captivity. This is the very, this is the epitome of, of taking your thoughts into captivity. Railroad track. Uh, the railroad track made me bounce. But I just wanted to pray for you uh, that God would begin to reveal his plan, his future in your life. Uh, I pray for that in our life. We are, uh, we are praying about some specific things, some new things, some new vision, new direction. Uh, God, I pray your kingdom come. God, I, I want to please you. Uh, I, I want to, to, I want our lives to please you. I want to please you as parents, as a husband. Uh, I, I pray, God, as a, that you would uh, use me as a great leader, uh, a voice of direction to the people that you've given us in our life, uh, to be the example. Um, God, I want you. I want you. I want the next thing. I want to do whatever it takes uh, to reach the next place, to do the, the what, to, to obey your voice. So I shut out all the other voices. We were. And like Carson's in the back seat right now. We don't ever uh, shut out his voice. Uh, I, but I shut out <laughs> all of the other voices. I, uh, and I listen, I lean in to hear what you're saying. And I, I just, uh, Taylor Roo. Is a LaRue there? I love you, LaRue. Um, so, God, I just pray for LaRue. God, that you will move in her life. That you would open her eyes and let her see the next thing. That you would uh, elevate her, God, to a new place. Uh, yes, Lord. God, I, I just I thank you for this new year. I thank you for this month of January and for uh, the, the call to, to just pull aside, draw aside, and, and try to hear you in a new way. God, I need you more, more than anything else. I need you. Uh, so I just, you now I pray for everybody that's following us during this prayer scope. God, that you would do things in their lives, that you would uh, visit them in their dream life, that you would give direction, that you would uh, uh, just do what you do. God, I pray no. for 
what you're doing at Covenant Church. God, I pray that even tonight as we, as we head to church, that you would do something and reveal something new to us. God, that you would uh, just manifest in an incredible way. God, let people's lives be changed. Let people be transformed in your presence. Let Nicole and I be transformed in your presence. Yes, Jesus. Love you so much. Our life is yours. And uh, so just take this time and focus and pray no. for for our future and for, for our friends that are watching. God, we just join together. We become uh, unified in our search and our pursuit. And so we just give it all to you in Jesus' name. I'm going to flip it around a second and say hey to y'all. We're driving to church and so um, so many people you know, ask questions about how do you do ministry and and you know be a mom and a dad and how does that all work sometimes all the parents on the periscope know what i'm talking about set up those hearts if you're a parent and um so this is how you do it right here you just do it in you do it you let them experience it while while you're here in the video game in the background carson can you say hi to the people tell us say hi to the camera and tell them where we're going tonight we're going Church. Yes, we are. We are going to church. Love y'all. I'm excited about 2016, and it's going to be an incredible year for all the, for those of us that are pursuing God and all that He Yay, has for us. Woohoo! All right, love y'all. I, I hijacked David's periscope for a second. Okay. <laughs>